Today we're gonna do a postpartum core workout on our mat. This is gonna be a phase two workout in the postpartum recovery plan. Welcome back ladies, my name is Tabitha. If you haven't been here before, I'm here to help all you busy ladies juggling jobs, careers, kiddos with no real time to exercise. I'm gonna give you exercise tips, tricks, routines, and even product reviews to help make fitness a part of your life. And today we are doing my postpartum recovery plan series. This is phase number two, and we're gonna do all core on our mat. Now, if you're looking for this playlist, I will link it down below. It's the postpartum recovery plan playlist. So if you're new to this, I would recommend you go to phase one. But today is gonna be an all core workout, three exercises. We're gonna do 15 rounds of each exercise. Do what you can. If it's a little bit too hard for you to complete all 15 reps or as many reps, depending on what exercise we do, just take a break, do what you can, take note of how much you were able to actually get done. And then the next time, try again and see if you can get more. Also, we're gonna go three rounds for this set. So if you can't make it all three rounds, it's okay, do your best. And next time you try again, you will do better. So grab your mat. Oh, I almost forgot. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell to get notified every time I post a new video. So grab your mat and let's head to the floor. First exercise we're gonna do is called a curl up. Now, do not be afraid. This is not a crunch and this is not a sit up. Now, it might look like one to you, but it's absolutely not. We're going to tuck our chins. Just put your hands nicely to the side and we're gonna lift just our upper shoulders off this ground here. You feel your core engage. Your belly should stay nice and flat. No coning, no doming. Keep it all tight and let's go back here. Good, nice small movement, and up, tuck, and down, good, two. Up, and down, and up, down. Keep going. Down, very good, watch for your belly, keep the core engaged, you should feel it in your upper core but it is giving your core the exercise it needs to heal. No pressure on the Leonea Alba because we're not going that high. And down, let's go five more. Four. Three. Two. Good. One. Very good, ladies. So next exercise we're gonna do is the Pilates 100. We're gonna do the easy version where our legs are at a 90 degree angle. We're gonna lift our head, tuck our chin to our chest. Now for the Pilates 100, it's pumping vigorously right here on the side of your body as your chin is tucked and your legs are up. I want you to really look down that core, keep it zipped up nice and tight. No coning, no doming. And as we're pumping, we go inhale for five, exhale for five. All right, we're gonna only go for five breaths, so 50 pumps total. Normally it's 10 breaths for 100 pumps total. If you can only make it one breath right now, that is okay. We're gonna do what we can. Form is the most important thing, so let's bring our legs up and up and let's go. And relax. Good, that was five pumps, so half of a Pilates 100. Now let's go into leg circles. Legs straight up, and let's go around. One, two, use the core. This is your rest. Four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Other leg. 
Now, if that was a little too easy for you, then you can bring your leg a little lower and let me demonstrate. Here we go. And one. And you can also make bigger circles. Two. Three. Four. But if you need it easier, go ahead and bring it up. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Bring it down. Let's go back to our curl ups. And chin tuck and up. One. Four. Pull that core nice and tight down. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Good job, ladies. Ten. Eleven. Good. 13. 14. And last one. And get ready for hundreds. Legs up. Tuck him in and. And down. Good. Back to leg circles. Hands up. And nice and wide. Two. Nice and relaxed. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, and switch legs. Down. Very good. Planes in the background. Our house is literally in the flight path to the airport. <laughs> so it gets really loud. So let's last round of curl up and let's go tuck that chin and Good job. We're going to do hundreds. Shake it out if you need to shake it a little bit. Legs up. Chin tuck. Head up. And let's go.
and down. Very good. Last round, leg circles. This shouldn't be too bad on your core. A nice core workout, but very relaxed. And three, four, five. Try to keep those hips stable as you move the leg. That's gonna get you more core engagement. goes another plane, <laughs> 14, and 15, and switch sides, and up, and rotate, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Leg down. And there you have it, ladies. Still, I always like to roll to my side and push up. You can never be too safe, especially if you're in the recovery phase. So I hope that core workout was good for you. Again, if you weren't able to make it all the way through, just do what you can and do it again next time. And then keep note of how far you can go the next time around. Remember, you're still recovering from baby and it takes a long time to have grace, but I know that you will get there. So as always, Stay positive, work hard, and God bless. Mahalo for joining me. Aloha.